Top, top, top the world, man. You know? it's good. It's good. All right, who's going? When you see Louisville, what do you see as you get ready to face them the second time? I see, I see a team that's um, really good. They're coming together as a basketball team. And I say really good because I think when you get towards the end of the year, uh, when we're starting to get a little bit more connected, I think they're playing some of that better basketball. Uh, they've figured out rotations, even though they've had some ups and downs and all that other stuff. And, but if you go back and you look at some of the recent games, you know, they're one-offs. But a few of those games, they played extremely well. And you think about our game at, at their place, you know, we got the big lead. Uh, you know, they cut it, um, cut the lead, even took the lead by one point. And obviously, we had to bounce back and finish. So it's a good basketball team. They got great pieces, and I think they're peaking at the right time. I guess they call those like you know trap game scenarios. How dangerous is it to get ready for? Them? I think every game and every game in this tournament is 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 one of them that you got to compete. I mean, you know, you guys know this, and I've been one of the ones saying it all along. Right now, they've got our uh, our league projected to get four teams in the tournament which I think everybody who covers the ACC knows that that's not right, that's not fair. Uh, we've got great teams, we've got great coaches, uh, great players, you know, great places to play. And so when I, I, I say that because every team, we got at least 11 teams that know that they have to win the tournament to have a chance to play in the NCAA. And so it makes everybody dangerous. Like, you know, everybody on, you know, in, in tournament situations, all it takes is a guy to get hot or for your team, a couple guys not to play well. And so anything can happen. And so I don't look at them as a dangerous team. I look at them as one of those teams that know that you have to win. We're in the same boat. In order to go to the tournament this year, we know that we have to win the ACC tournament. Yeah. And honestly, man, like we came here we came here to win it all, okay? And what you do is you take one game at a time. That's what it is, okay? Everybody's got to be connected. We've asked this for the last uh, three or four weeks to stay together, to limit your mistakes, to play hard, okay? This is the time when all of the work that you put in, that it all comes together for you. Like, you know, we want to get you to, I want to get to the point where when we're playing these games, we get four or five guys playing well on the same day. Hey, that's what it's about. And you have to do whatever you got to do to help this team win, whatever it takes. Okay, that's all you got to do. Okay, it's it's no ego. I'm going to accept this role. I'm going to do this. I'm going to be uh, I'm gonna be that guy. If you need me to defend, I might not have it offensively, but I'm going to do whatever I got to do. And the voices on the bench and the voices around and the energy that we have to give, it's what it's all about. You know? I love our opportunity, but our opportunity is going to be based on how much energy and pride that we play with. Okay? Good on, good. Yeah. Good. Together. One, two, three, together. <laughs> <laughs>
What could possibly bring them all together? Everyone agrees on the best team in smart home security. CPI. From protecting your teeth and gums, to restoring your smile, to sponsoring your local team, Tar Heel Periodontics is the premier periodontal practice of the Triangle community. Our team of highly skilled doctors provide dental care as individual as you are, working with you to build a personalized treatment plan to create the beautiful, healthy smile of your dreams. With offices conveniently located across the Triangle and Central North Carolina, you're never far from the Tar Heel Periodontics family. Visit our website or call now. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. This segment of One with Wolfpack is presented by Coca-Cola. We're courtside at Capital One Arena in downtown Washington, D.C. in the 71st ACC Tournament. The Wolfpack is the 10th seed in this event, and its only chance to make the NCAA Tournament is to uh, win it all here in Washington. And to do that, NC State's going to have to win five games in five days. That is a uh, Herculean feat, but that's what the pack is going to try to do. Okay, here's your keys right here. you got to leave everything out on the floor. Okay, when it's a tournament situation, you, you leave everything where it's at. You play as hard as you can in that situation. Okay? Set the tone early by defending and rebounding. Okay? You got to let them know early. None of that going to happen tonight or today. You got to do a great job with that. Okay? Uh, survive in advance. This is move on. Hey, you survive by you play as hard as you can. You advance by the job that you do. Okay? And then let's go back to our art. Think about all the things that we talked about the entire year, what our art was, art was all about, okay? Accountability, relentless, toughness, together, okay? That's what it's about, okay? And the last thing is, let's go out here, man, and let's go have fun. Let's go again, together. One, two, three, together. The priority for NC State basketball is beating Louisville today. Put yourself in a position to play another game tomorrow. That's all you can focus on. That's all you can think about. Because if you get ahead of yourself and you assume that you're going to beat Louisville for a second time this season, that's that's not a that's not a good way to approach tournament basketball. Hey, we got to protect the paint, man. We got to protect the paint. Guard, keep them out. We go, White. Let's go. Mike James. James to Clark starts to drive. Now to the cutting James to Huntley Hatfield. Corner jumper is good. That's a two pointer for Huntley Hatfield from near the left baseline, and Louisville as a 5-2 to two lead. Here's Jaden Taylor driving to the foul line. Left wing to O'Connell, long bomb for three, good from the left side. Good job playmaking by Jaden Taylor. In reverse layup, got it. He cut in from the right uh, side, all the way to the basket. Nobody picked him up. Johnson scores, and it's Louisville 7, NC State 5. Here's Taylor driving the lane for the left wing. He scores on a right-hand layup. Oh, with Jaden Taylor deep left. He drives to the top of the key. Has it knocked away by Scott Clark. Clark on a steal and a drive. He'll jam it. And it's back-to-back -back turnovers by Jaden Taylor trying to do a little too much. He needs to be steady in this game with uh, DJ Horn probably not available. Hey, six or seven right now. Let's turn it up. Let's go. Take the paint. Take the paint. The Louisville playing with tremendous energy here early in this game, and the cards jumped out to a 13 to 7 lead on NC State. As Louisville has knocked down six of seven from the field, and the Cardinals are getting the ball in the paint. And gets it away to Sky Clark. Left wing to White. Shoots for three. No good for the left side. And the rebound to Diara, and he's running. Taylor gets the pass up the floor to. Uh, Casey Morissell to Middlebrooks to Diara, who cuts in from the left side, goes to the basket, hooks it up with a right hand, hits the glass, and goes down. And the arc to Taylor along the sideline. They try to trap him. He drives to the elbow, cross court skip pass to O'Connell. Into the corner for a jump shot for three. Good by three out pass from the left corner. Shot clock down to 11. He gives it up to James Ball, knocked away, stolen by O'Connell. O'Connell a breakaway layup. Good by Michael O'Connell. Seven points for O'Connell, and it's 30 to 26. Pack pulls to within four. Kenny Payne seen enough. Timeout, Louisville. Hey, 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 Clark, hey, Clark has got 15, man. We got locked him down. Hey, let's go. Good job. Casey, good defense, brother. Very good defense. All right, fellas. 
Hey, now we're playing. Cam, just go straight through that. Oh, what a good job, man. What a nice fight. Good job. The defense is doing it right now. For the rebound for Louisville. Headband pass to Johnson. Johnson tried to go inside. Ball knocked away. Stolen by Taylor for NC State. Taylor on the run. White ring to Woods. Woods to the basket. Pass break. Layup. Rims in. That has a great defensive play by Middlebrooks. And the cards have the ball to the person of Sky Clark. Right wing. Clark drives. Baseline. Stolen away by O'Connell. Long down the floor to Morsell. Fast break jam. I'll tell you, O'Connell has been fantastic in this game. Lobs it for Huntley Hatfield left of the lane. He turns on Diara. He'll back him down, back him down. Four to shoot, three to shoot. Underneath, trying to hook it up. Diara blocks the shot, and the pack comes up with the ball. Here's Taylor up the left sideline. Taylor in a breakaway, jams it down at the other end. Cardinal ball. Here's Sky Clark off a screen, driving to his right. He'll force up a jumper, partially blocked, and that's the half. Louisville will go into the locker room with a 1.46 to 45 lead. This next 20 minutes, you got to bring your defense. When we come out, I want to establish ourselves on the defensive end. You miss a shot, you miss a shot. You didn't try to miss it. Get it back on the defensive end. Have that mentality. If I miss one, I'm going to get it back for you, coach. But I'm going to do it the right way. Play with each other. We don't need heroes. We walked our way back in the game because we defended. We got deflections. We raised our deflections up. We played by the defense. That's why we're in. Now you got to establish yourself on both ends of the floor. They won the first half because we didn't give them any resistance. Now it's time for us to step our hands up and go get this one, all right? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. On top to Morsell. Morsell puts it on the deck. He knocks over a man. Step back. Jumper for three. Good. And NC State's got its largest lead of the game at 50 to 46. 54 50 Wolfpack, 16 26 to go. Orsell gets the pass right wing, dives the basket, misses the layup. Put back good by Ben Middlebrooks. Man, he has been dynamite on the offensive class today. Turnover on Louisville, number 14. Here's Casey Morsell down the floor underneath the DR and jams it. And another one of those live ball turnovers that leads to an easy basket. Then the key to the game today. Behind the arc, left wing to Burns. Cross-court skip pass goes to Taylor. Shot in the air for three. Good! From the right side for Jade Taylor. 13 for Taylor. That's a huge shot. Burns is double teamed in the right-hand corner. Cross-courts it to Taylor. Taylor shot in the air for three. Good! From left of the key. And twice, those shots came available when Louisville decided to double team DJ Burns. He's not missed the shot off the back iron. And O'Connell rebounds. He quickly gets it into the front court to Taylor. Taylor in the basket. Layup good. That should seal it. And the pack survives and advances. Final score from Capital One Arena in downtown Washington, D.C. Game two of the ACC tournament. The Wolfpack 94, Louisville 85. Together. One, two, three, together. Get ready, Carolina. The Great Outdoors Spring Sales Event is on. Discover great savings on a great selection of Ford vehicles, like Ford Explorer, the best-selling SUV in America, Ford Bronco and Bronco Sport, or the powerful Ford F-150. Great adventures and big savings are calling. Get to the Great Outdoors Spring Sales Event today. Drive away with 1.9% financing for 72 months with up to 4150 package savings, plus no payments for 90 days on select Ford trucks. Only at your Carolina Ford dealer. From protecting your teeth and gums, to restoring your smile, to sponsoring your local team, Tar Heel Periodontics is the premier periodontal practice of the Triangle community. Our team of highly skilled doctors provide dental care as individual as you are, working with you to build a personalized treatment plan to create the beautiful, healthy smile of your dreams. With offices conveniently located across the Triangle and Central North Carolina, you're never far from the Tar Heel Periodontics family. Visit our website or call now. These mascots represent some of the most heated rivalries in college sports. What could possibly bring them all together? Everyone agrees on the best team in smart home security. CPI. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. 
and your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Uh, after the Duke game, you, you basically said that all your eggs are now in this tournament's basket here, and you won now, you got another one coming up tomorrow. What's your message to the team? How do you approach it now to keep them from looking big picture? And just what's ahead? You know, we know all we know is we play at seven o'clock against Syracuse, and it's a one-game tournament. And you got to be able to win that one game to be able to advance, and uh, we'll be locked in. We're glad that we do play a seven o'clock game. We got a little time to to get back to the hotel, get a little rest, and uh, obviously try to prepare tonight with a little bit of film, and then you know do a walkthrough tomorrow and get ready to play a good Syracuse team. Corey, this will be the third meeting between these two teams. The first couple of games, well, we know how that went. Syracuse won a bowl. Yeah, it went Syracuse way, but they say that it's hard to beat a good team three times. So what we're going to find out tonight, is North Carolina State a good team? They absolutely looked like it yesterday, scoring a season-high 94 points. In front of a dirty double mirror, they found me, and I love myself. The world is a ghetto, guns Wynn sets up uh, tonight's matchup and a third face-off this season with Syracuse. Hey, they've won too many games against us. Play harder than them dudes, man. Let's get out there and let's fight. You know, I, I tell you every day, we all we got, man. Hey, lay everything on in the line. You are older dudes, man. Let's go get one. The Orange are the number seven seed in the ACC tournament, and they've won four of their last five games. Winner will take on the number two seed, Duke, at seven tomorrow. Mintz with a pull up pop and he'll drain that. Burns gets the return. Working on Brown. That should be an entertaining duel as he hits that one. Casey Morsell. Morsell left wing to Diara. Diara left of the lane to Burns. Backs in against Brown. Backs in. Spence. Here comes the double team. Shoots over a glass and good. So both teams attacking the basket here early. And here comes DJ Horn off the bench and gets a hand from the fans. DJ Horn. Have any of us ever been that excited about <laughs> I'm anything? not sure. Winning the lottery. Copeland bottled up downstairs, got the pass free somehow. Taylor couldn't hit the shot. Amazing he got that pass free. The long jumper will be nothing but net by O'Connell. And O'Connell was super aggressive yesterday. 16 points for him with the absence of Horn. Diara hands off behind the arc right wing to Morcell. Now to Diara, drives right baseline, lost the ball, got it back, puts it in. It's right sideline to Copeland. He has it knocked away by Burns. Double team, whips it to the left side of Starling. Starling, straight line drive to the basket, clears it out to Brown for a straight on three. Got it off the window. Holy cow. That's the fan, I love it. Hey, good job, man. Keep the fan. Hey, the game's arguing. Don't give them all that. When they try, just roll up. Don't reach on them. You've got to make the shot, and the problem with that is North Carolina State 4 of 14 from the film, only 1 for 7 from beyond the arc. A beautiful find from D.J. Burns, and this time, Jaden Taylor is able to knock down the three wall. Copeland straight on, got a good look, but off the back of that iron. Rebound pulled down by Diara. Outlet pass goes to Taylor, and he's running up the left sideline. Let's see if Horn gets involved offensively. Burns with a touch. What a tough angle, but he makes a lot of those shots. Post picked off by Mintz, and he's running. Mintz to Taylor. Fast break, layup, missed it. And the rebound pulled uh, off by Taylor. And here comes NC State running from left to right. Taylor to the line, to the lane, to the hole. He missed the shot. Followed up good by Diara. And it's 21-18. The action back and forth here. Gets it to Taylor. Taylor brings it up the right sideline into the front court for NC State. Here's Taylor giving to Burns in the midcourt area. Burns backs in. Now to O'Connell. Shoots for three left wing. Got it. Second three of the game for Michael O'Connell. A high arching bomb. And a timeout called by Syracuse. We bring that ball. Mo, I love where you go to go for two. And Coach talked about 50 50 balls right here. We gave up a couple, but we, we can't be leaking out. We all got to come help Mo and Ben rebound. Go keep playing personnel. Keep playing personnel. Hey, I love him, Mom. O'Connell on the dribble. Taylor trying that baseline. Oh, tough sledding underneath, but he made the shot. That was a brutally tough shot. He's got 10. Q's running. Here's Mintz. Tries to throw an underhand toss to Copeland. And it threw it away. Marcel straight away drives on Copeland. Down low. Fade away jumper right of the lane. Good by Casey Marcel. Maybe that'll get him going. Good first half for the Wolfpack. 
in a back to back game situation and NC State has a 35 32 lead. Everybody come over with a sense of urgency. The first three minutes of the half, you got to establish yourself, get out there. They're talking because they're frustrated. Don't get involved with that. Okay? You just play. Let them talk all that about, hey, they're living in the past. We're living in the moment right now. Okay? So you guard, you defend, you get on the play, know where we're at. When Stallings coming off the ball screen, you got to do a good job getting up on him because he can shoot that. Your mig and nail has been good. Haven't really hurt us with that short roll. Make sure we get in there, all right? Let's go, guys. Let's go, man. Let's go, man. Hey, 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 complete energy, complete fire, complete desire. Let's go get it. To go. One, two, three. Yeah, yeah. there. So again, hey. Horn with a pull up at the elbow, and that'll go. It's driving, and the arc going up hard with the rejection. Horn behind the arc. Now to Morcell, top of the key, underneath the DR, the birds, point blank, lays it up good. He wins it back. Somehow, a second effort, and switched in by Taylor. That was a crazy possession. It shows you the great hands of DJ Burns. He drives the basket, shoots a higher, and runner got it. Wow, what a tough shot. Yeah, a very low percentage shot, but Starling, he's a shot maker. Into the basket by Horn, throws it up off the glass, missed it. Rebound Burns. Into the corner for Taylor's three ball. Good. 16 to 2 over the last six minutes. And another fifth. Born to Taylor, back to Horn, and he'll lay in. And a big time fast break. That'll bring it in time on Syracuse. Hey, 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 Three or four minutes. I'm going to say the hip flexor feels pretty good for DJ Horn right now. Here's Taylor to swoop in, and now the pack making all kinds of shots. I'll tell you what, with this backcourt, the way they're playing right now, this NC State team is dangerous. Out to O'Connell, straight on three. Good by Michael O'Connell. Coach Keats last night said this is a team not just playing dangerous, as you referred to earlier, Corey. Desperate. And already said four ACC teams are getting in. That means 11 teams are in this predicament where they need the tournament to win. He said this is a team that understands what they need to do together. Morcel on the other end. Well, this was actually a close game six or seven minutes ago. It is no longer. The Wolfpack is rolling in Washington. And the pack will survive and advance. And sometimes, Tony, adversity brings out the real character in a team. We back. We back. We back. We never left. Don't worry. One with Wolfpack is sponsored in part by Carolina Ford Dealers. See your Carolina Ford Dealer, proud sponsor of NC State Athletics. Get ready, Carolina. The Great Outdoors Spring Sales Event is on. Discover great savings on a great selection of Ford vehicles, like Ford Explorer, the best-selling SUV in America, Ford Bronco and Bronco Sport, or the powerful Ford F-150. Great adventures and big savings are calling. Get to the Great Outdoors Spring Sales Event today. Drive away with 1.9% financing for 72 months with up to 4150 package savings, plus no payments for 90 days on select Ford trucks. Only at your Carolina Ford dealer. These mascots represent some of the most heated rivalries in college sports. What could possibly bring them all together? Everyone agrees on the best team in smart home security. CPI. From protecting your teeth and gums, to restoring your smile, to sponsoring your local team, 
Tar Heel Periodontics is the premier periodontal practice of the Triangle community. Our team of highly skilled doctors provide dental care as individual as you are, working with you to build a personalized treatment plan to create the beautiful, healthy smile of your dreams. With offices conveniently located across the Triangle and Central North Carolina, you're never far from the Tar Heel Periodontics family. Visit our website or call now. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at nclectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. One with Wolfpack is sponsored in part by North Carolina's electric cooperatives, powering a brighter future for people and communities we serve. Speaking of this win, this is not a team that entered this tournament with a lot of momentum. Describe over these last two games what you've seen. Yeah, man, we've just been as locked in as, uh, as we can be. And, and I feel like we've been locked in as we've been all season. And uh, we're going into this tournament, we just kind of went in with a why not us mindset. And uh, I think we're, you know, showcasing that right now. Mohamed Diar with 14 rebounds. How big was he for you guys tonight? He was big, man. When Mo wants to be like Mo, he's the X factor for this team. And I'm glad that he showed up on the biggest stage when it all matters. Thanks. Congrats on the win. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Okay, what a great win. Okay, and I'll tell you why. Okay, we talked about before the disrespect that we were getting from, and this has nothing to do to Syracuse, but the disrespect that they were showing us every time that they beat us the two times. We talked about grit, we talked about staying together, we talked about fighting. Okay, your second half was great. Like what you did the second half was unbelievable. You sit down, you guard it, you competed. Uh, you played together, okay, you stuck together, okay? That's two, okay? Remember I told you, man, we didn't we didn't come here to just to get two, we moved to the next one, okay? Everybody understand that? That was great. When we, hey, when we won our first game, I was like, oh, I don't know. Now we want another one, now we're gonna stack these games, okay? We on the same schedule that we were on, we'll get back, we'll um, watch film, we'll eat, we'll get up tomorrow, prepare like champions like we are, Prepare like the group that nobody wants to play. And we got another game tomorrow night at seven, okay? Understand that? Understand what our job is, okay? Celebrate, have a good time. But it's only gonna last about a couple hours and then we focus in on Duke, okay? Another revenge tour, right? You know, we had that game at home. Remember what happened towards the end, okay? Remember how we played early on? We're gonna be on top of our stuff, okay? I love you. You did a hell of a job, okay? Second day in a row, let's get some ice cream. All right, yeah. Yeah. Ice, ice. Together. One, two, three. Together. It was about 10 days ago, Duke went to Raleigh. Pretty much handled NC State. They won that game by 50. How is tonight, if you can give us a checklist, going to be different for them? Well, it's a difference in confidence for the Wolfpack coming into this game, and they have all the ingredients necessary to upset the Blue Devils. Oh, oh Diara is right. As he goes for the slam and is screamed out. He might tap down high, Marcel grabbed it. He got there first and finished it last. O'Connell gets it off. And oh! Michael O'Connell banks in a prayer. For this group of NC State players, now though they take on an in-state rival, the top seed, and a team playing extremely well. The last time NC State won it was way back in 1987. From the